Yeah. Hey, man. Hey, 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 so listen, man. Man, people listen, just financially okay. frustrated, man. They just okay, financially listen, frustrated, I wouldn't, bro. Man, I don't, I don't want this to be about this, but we're going to go ahead and go there real quick. Is he live right I, now, bro? He live right now. I get off and pop in my feet. So you know me. I click. I'm thinking you going to respond about me to the video I posted earlier. Yeah, because you posted the video, not me. I exposed. Yeah, you did not do nothing. That's did me on my own. And I exposed him because he was selling Q-sips for the birth certificate. So, yeah, I get your Q-sips put on your birth certificate. It's part of a new package he got out now. So, I exposed that it's a scam for the people that actually issue Q-sips. If you don't have a Q-sip from them, it's, it's not legitimate. So get on there live, and then he just got your name. Like, I helped him get out of 21 years. I helped him stay in this house with his wife. You know, she wasn't going to be around if he got that time. First of all, why are you talking about anyways? So then he's in, like, come to get his bitch ass. It's a whole disrespectful shit. Like, motherfucker, you ain't say not one thing. Like, it just... It kills me because it's like, oh yeah, I ain't got, no, I ain't got no hatred for it. I ain't got love for his bitch ass. Like trolling. Then you got the lap dog talking shit. But the whole time is, nigga, I'm the one that got your ass in the L. I'm the one that got his ass in the L. But he's talking about. Me. Say, but he right. keep talking about you. Talk about me. Talk about me. Say my name again, so I can keep that pressure on your neck. That's the that's the sucker shit I'm talking about. Yeah, just cold blooded. Y'all about to hand out feed you, and then people, oh, he's scamming. He a snake. He came over here. To, I don't know what the fuck. Like he ain't getting. Ball, man, can I, can I, this? I listen. I I thank you for for acknowledging sucker shit, bro. It, it, sucker, sucker shit. Stuff. First of all, sucker let me shit. just say this for the record for the umpteenth time. People, not you people that's watching, but people. Are stupid, and if you you can go and be with whoever you want to be with, but if you over there listening to that man tell lies, clear lies, lies. Now, let's clear. Now let's clarify this. I already said this. How on God's green earth did that ugly buck tooth, red <laughs> greasy wall, the duplex save me from doing twenty one years? What did he do? Seriously, uh, question. What did he do? He was nothing, the nothing. conduit. He was the conduit of me meeting someone through him. He didn't do nothing. He don't know nothing about what I did or going through. How did he prevent me from doing 21 years? And people are believing that. How did he do that? I heard he didn't even have nothing to do with it. I heard he didn't even have nothing to do with it. He, nothing. Let me tell you, the think tank, one member of the think tank, one member, his name is Flip, gave me the information to get out of my case. But the information he gave me, I already had 75% of it already based on my own studies. But I'm not negating that. Flip helped me. Midwest didn't do anything for me. Remember, you guys, you guys are not thinking. He was telling you he wasn't even part of the think tank, which he lied because I got the, all the videos. So what did he do for me? What? He did not do anything for me. So stop telling people that. Stop. What did you do for yourself? Why are you still, in the, why are you still living the life you're living? You have not shown not one proof of you living your life. You showing Nothing. and selling status corrections, which my stupid ass paid seven hundred and fifty dollars for. My stupid ass, and right, that's all you though. did. You didn't do nothing else. You don't. Know, Forty four years old. That's a bunch of bull. My IDs work. I already played it's, my video. Got, 
of the audio of the police putting me over. I had IDs way before. So what is he doing? He got a diplomatic. He got a dip. He got a. He got. He got a diplomatic ID for five fifty. Come on, man. This dude, he's an idiot. First of all, I'm going to say this. I'm finna. I'm, I'm finna hurt some pe people's feelings. I know why I was over there, and I got my remedy. I didn't get it from his dumb ass. I got it from someone who was way more intelligent. For the record, right. he didn't tell me to put my stuff in the case as evidence. He didn't know nothing about that. Unk told, told me. Now, did he introduce me to Unk? Yes, he did. But he didn't tell me what Unk told me. So how does he get credit for, come on, man, people, y'all need to use common sense. And another thing, too, the guy does not know anything. Nothing. He doesn't. So if you're Nothing. following him to this day, I'm going to say it. You stupid. And you deserve everything you get. You are 100% stupid. You people go on this live every morning. Yeah. Two hours. Yeah. While he shows you some homeless people on Philadelphia or. What the fuck that got to do with myself, anything? Or Dirty Wood or whoever else can come up and talk because he's feeding his YouTube hours. That's it. Yeah. That's it. He's not giving you any value. Now, when I start, what, what substance has he given you? What substance has he yeah. given you? Has he broken any statues, any congressional records like what we did over here? Has he done any of that? Has he done okay. just a morsel? Ooh. Ooh. Teeny wait, wait, wait. Hey, check, check this out. Check this out. Jerrica just said something. Yes, Jerrica, you got remedy from the think tank. Can you please put down a specific person who helped you out the think tank? Let's be let's be specific. Because in my situation, the think tank didn't help me. One person did. And all them people that paid $500, $500 to Alexandra and Midwest got no remedy. Because I stopped that. I several stopped people, it. Several people sent Midwest money through Cash App. $500, right. $1,000, right. and several right. people sent money to Alexandra. But now all of a sudden, he wants to distance himself. Right. Dude, you can't distance yourself. You took them people money. I they took the money. $5 for my remedy in the think tank. And I gave it to Alexandra. And I got they my took remedy. That. But they everybody took else money. paid me $500 did not get their remedy because there was no remedy to get. Now, None. they were trying. I'm not going to lie. They were trying. I'm not going to say it. If they were trying. And when I say they, it was mainly flip. Now, it's another person. I'm not going to say that name, and you know why. Yeah, 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 yeah. They knew their information, but that's it. That's that it. That was it. That that's was it. it. That was it. Now, let me just say this. For all you folks, and I'm going to say it, and I'm only going to say this because I just read something. For all you folks that got my name in your mouth calling me a snake and a traitor like Frequency Hackers and all y'all stupid motherfuckers because you're stupid with no remedy, none. You don't have none. not one remedy. None. none. You need to come over here. Matter of fact, I don't even want you over here. Stay where you at and don't get your remedy and live the life that you deserve to live. But how dare you call me a snake and say I'm not honorable when I've been nothing but honorable until new evidence presents itself. And the evidence that presents itself that the math wasn't mathing. It wasn't. I wanted to believe, well, let's make it 100% full transparency. I wanted to believe everything that that man was saying over there on that channel, Midwest EDU. I wanted to believe that. But it's just not true. It's not. So why are you continuing to go over there and get remedy, hoping to get remedy, and you know you're not going to get anything? You know you're not. You know you're not. And that man is over there degrading me, talking about my wife and all that. That's all he has to fall back on. Where is his remedy? Where is Never. the deposit that he went to the bank that day? Nowhere. He, said he went to the bank again and got a deposit. He still hasn't yeah. shown that. He still hasn't shown it. But yet, you <laughs> guys are still over there every day. And he hasn't shown yeah. you the proof. 
that was this new client's money. About four of them bought some stuff. I already got the scoop. About four or five people bought some status corrections from me. I'm sorry. Who has a who has a mentor? First of all, everybody that I know of, and I'm gonna say this. He don't even fuck with. I don't even fuck with him. I know he doesn't. I'm gonna let you say that part first. He be lying. Oh, hear me out, don't he be me. lying. He don't even be talking to Unk. He don't even be talking to Unk. Unk don't even fuck with that man no more. Well, we Go got ahead. proof. But I, ain't, I don't want to blast my. But we got proof that Unk may talk to him, but Unk don't fuck with him like that. Because we know he right. talked to him, but it be it's been already been proven that Midwest called Unk his mentor. Right. Unk doesn't call Midwest his uh, his mentee, and we know for a fact. That Unc said, of course, that special deposit not true. He never came close to doing none of that. He just helps him out on banking situations. That's what he said. And we have the proof he said it. But we didn't want to bring all that up. Shit, I would. I'm going to burn oh, his man. ass up in my next video. See, but. Sip, 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 hey, subscribe. Make, I'm going to burn his ass up. But he wants to go make videos and make it personal. All because about you. Lying to the people. And he's talking about me when I'm not even talking about him. That was I'm you. talking about it. I'm exposing them. I called the QSA people day and yes. shut down whatever he trying to sell. He said it. No birth certificates, no court case, no social security. If it's not coming from us, it ain't what it is. And what did he say last week? Oh, everybody, make sure you get your QSA pulled for your birth certificate. People in the chat, they probably some same people that's over here now. Hey, how much it costs to get my BC QSA? Yeah, I heard people out there. Look at you desperate motherfuckers end up getting caught up on some bullshit because you are impersonating federal securities of the United States government, which is a criminal offense. In one case, you have someone right now that I'm going to bring on my live next week mm -hmm. in which they got a knock at the door by some ABC boys regarding the Q-sips and they spilt the beans, spill the beans, they spilt the beans mm -hmm. on old boy over there. Right. What you don't realize is the FBI and the Secret Service and them are baking his ass a cake. He don't even know. Man. And I know this. I got the answer. Ask you know, that's some real shit. I try to warn him before my videos. Now, fuck him. He, he gonna be the all right. Investigation. He, he, he's done the investigation. It's all on him for the fraud he's doing. Yeah. That's yeah. all on him. That's the that all ABC you boys investigating him. Yep, yep, they're investigating him. They're investigating him. And they're investigating him. They're, get, all... yep, they're, investigating him. they're investigating him right now. I know this for a fact because the, mm. the person went into the bank. Person went into the bank with the same fucking Q-sips that they got from him. The bank looked at it. Went to the back office, came back out and said, I'm sorry, we're not going to be doing that. Who'd you get this from? They started asking a whole bunch of questions. They were telling about that it was in the group. They were studying. They was learning this. And they said, Like most people do, can't criminal. hold water. That, right. Yeah, can't hold water. I'm in the group. I was in the group on YouTube. I'm studying from this guy. This guy said, so already put his name out there off the brick. Just gave him up just like that. And they would say, hey, can we get it back? They asked. And they said, no, this is criminal. Uh, this is This is going up to the back office for a criminal mm -hmm. investigation. They wouldn't let him leave with the documents. About two wow. weeks later, they get a visit. They get a visit from the ABC boys and they ask them to explain this. What other stuff they doing? They say they confiscated about five folders out of them. And then they said, be on standby. We may be coming back again. They got scared to death. And of course they are, they, yeah. They gave and I know you're not up. lying. I know you're not yeah. because we are listening. So up. that... That's why I'm not worried about it. And then they asked him, who you get it from? Guess the name they said. Me yeah, I don't know. They got it from him. So mm. now they watching, they watching, and now they investigating. You cannot impersonate no motherfucker securities in the United States. You can't have no fraudulent securities on instruments fucking with these people's securities. You playing games. Right. So everybody Man. that's following then, continue to follow him. But don't come, don't everybody rush on this side of the fence when that shit all come crashing down. They can run over it's all they want. It don't matter. Cause what that, man, that it doesn't matter. I wish, I'm well. I wish I knew their name first, and that's why we got I all. I wish I knew their name. They yeah, going back and forth. They going there. But, but, but listen, them same people gonna be on his live in the morning at eight thirty nine, whatever he go. 
talking about nothing, desperate folks. And, and, and I'm going to say this. I don't mean to be harsh and cruel, but it's the truth. People need to hear this. Me and Wes is not that smart. I'm sorry. He's not. Let's use kind of- say, don't judge him. Let me out, let me out. <laughs> Hear me, out, hear me out, hear me out. The man went into the bank just this week. Went into the bank with a maroon scully, a maroon pullover. No buzzer suit. With a no business suit. Birth certificate in his hand to try to go take care of some business and you are following him. Are you guys idiots or what? This man went nah. into the bank with his buck teeth, ugly ass, with a burgundy scully, a burgundy pullover, thinking he doing something, and you have the mitigated goal to believe that mess on the private side of the bank, looking like a thug, matching that ugly ass, his damn outfit matched that ugly ass wall that he show every morning that got grease stains on it, a damn duplex. Are you kidding me? He ain't even going there with a suit. He ain't have a suit on. No suit, no tie, no, 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 no polo, no, no suit jacket. He tell when a person show you who they are, believe them. But you People know, are idiots, because you're desperate. I'm talking to desperate. whoever who in my life right now ain't gonna be their dumb ass over on his shit tomorrow morning. Or get off here and go over there with y'all dumb ass. I'm hoping I'm offending you. Get the fuck off my life. Bye. I don't like stupid yeah. ass people. Get the fuck off my life. Yeah. And go back over there. Because I don't want you here. I don't want you under no assumed name. None of that. And I'm going to make this private. And I want you to pay for this information. Come on now. Y'all yeah. are stupid. You stupid. Yo. And you follow Yo. this man. Yo, this he man don't go into the bank. Oh my God. The dude he is a fucking moron. And you are following him. How can you follow somebody you know for a fact you're smarter than them? How? You and that, and now that's the sad. That's the sad part. That half of them are smarter than him. But you don't even go into a bank. You don't even go into a bank with a suit on, dress casual, to talk fuck business you go look like you just came right off the block you know how many times this man done went into a bank with a birth certificate and try to get it cash he's been trying to get that birth certificate cash since 2022 he's a and that's around the time when that's around the time when i first met him he been trying to get his shit cash since 2022 and every bank that he goes to denies him but they know why they deny him because he stopped talking about it he went to the bank with the same birth certificate with a mm -hmm. fraudulent securities on it. You go look at my video. And I'm not just saying this to get numbers on my video. Go look at my video. QCIPs are only issued by QCIPs Global. And if you hear, I say, so is it possible to get a QCIP paraphrase mm -hmm. with a birth certificate? He said, no. So why is he going there in the bank? With a birth certificate with a QCIP number on it, with the people that actually issue the QCIPs, the real corporation that issues them says you can't get a QCIP number from a birth certificate, Social Security, court case. So why is he still going into a bank report? What banking terms or what literal language or uh terms have you used that have you had have you have you heard this man use? He doesn't. He doesn't know any None. statutes. He doesn't know any codes. All he know is of paperwork that he's going to do with no explanation. And you people are following him because you're desperate. Dirty Woods is a sovereign citizen. Dirty Woods is a sovereign citizen. You need to stop being gets desperate, desperate people and use common sense. Stop being Dirty Woods is a sovereign citizen. He's a sovereign citizen, bro. Dirty Woods gives them the shit to go live with the people. Now, all the members only people for that little last class they had about whatever the fuck it was. Now they get some virtual NDA. If y'all don't understand the scheme and the scam that's going on, you crazy. If they can't show you no lean removed, no action taken, house dis house satisfied. If they can't show you that. And it can't on, show man. you. Hey, look, I sent this in. Look at my credit score now. Y'all seen this before? Y'all seen it after? Look, that's proof. actual proof that proof. this person is on the right path. 
if he's talking about IRS checks and IRS and he can't show nothing like that, that shows that sitting there or 846 refund issue to about, yeah, man, uh, special deposit. He couldn't even look in the fucking camera. He couldn't even look in the camera. Go to that IRS special deposit. And it comes one day after, me, after I put his ass on the rotisserie grill on this podcast. And now all of a sudden, after I cooked his ass by turning the camera off because he didn't want people to see the nature of his transaction. Because that money he withdrew from the bank was nothing more than yeah, people who brought that status then. correction from him. Now he goes to the bank this time with the camera on. Fuck he that. doesn't. He didn't even allow the time for his story to marinate and to mature. That's how bad of an idiot he is. He forgets. He forgot the old. He forgot the basics. See, that's what I'm talking about. You guys are not. You guys are following somebody who's an idiot. He doesn't know the basic common, the facts about the IRS deposits and things like that. He did, he did know that the only people that could get a direct deposit are individuals and persons. He didn't know that. Was he the one out of his own mouth that said he does everything through his foundation? So how in the hell did you get a, a direct deposit? How? And on top of that, how did you get it in less than 48 hours? How? You guys let that man get away with it. <laughs> you let that man get right. away with that shit. You they let him get that. away with it. And yeah, yep. and they still over there listening to that lying idiot. This they let him get away with it. They asked no questions. 48 hours and didn't show you no proof. And then had the mitigated goal, which y'all dumbass who believed it, goes to the bank and get the cash out, which is against the total principle of what we were doing. Who does that? Facts. Only desperate people and only desperate people follow him. And again, if you following him and you over here, I'm begging you, get off of here because you're not educated enough or astute enough to be here. I just told you eloquently with Lamont, this is not an overnight situation. The overnight shit is over there on M-Dub E-D-U where all the dumb folks is who desperate and about to lose their damn house and they core and thinking they finna get some silver on a thousand percent compounded interest. This for all y'all dumb motherfuckers. Go over there. I don't want you here. I want the astute. Yes. I want the ones that know that when you come here yes. or wherever you go, the information you get, you got to study, you got to learn it, and then you got to go put it into fruition. But the information is there and it's valid. I want them students. Don't come over here if you're trying to save your house tomorrow because it's not going to be saved. You're going to lose it. You got to lose something before you gain it. Make that your slogan for 2024 because it's the truth. You're going to lose it before you gain. You got to understand this. And if you and, want and, the quick and, remedy, and, if you want your sad family, part, if you want that status correction to save your life without no explanation on how to use it, if you want to learn this process, oh, I got this special deposit job, but you know what, y'all? I got this special deposit job, but you know what? I can't even tell you how I did it. I can't even tell how I did it. Yeah. Y'all yeah, stupid. And guess, yeah. and, and guess what? Man. And guess what? And it's the same people that he charged to do this. And they oh ain't asked no questions about this. They ain't even asked no questions about this. So if you did yours, what's up with mine? How you do mine? And they ain't even asked the questions. Yo, they, Otis, they did not even ask not one question to question. Of course not. They did not of ask not. nothing. That's because of Desperation and greed, desperate. and they don't want and the they, hope to be. And they killed. already know the answer, and they already know the answer. So I asked the question, and they know. don't want it confirmed. First of that's all, that's crazy. That's sad. Man, that's sad. He's selling stuff that he hadn't even done in his damn self. Has anybody asked him again? Had did he send in his silver? Did he hold a class today telling somebody that he gonna tell the people what to do? He didn't even did his. Because if he did, why he still living in that ugly ass house? Not trying to be funny. God, you know I'm not. But I'm just saying, I'm just keeping it real. If I said somebody was my mentor, I wouldn't shit. be living the way I, 
Yeah, your house look like his house now. That red wall back there. Turn that color off. That's disgusting. I know. I know. I'm trying. I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get myself straight over here. Stop it. No. Stop it. I'm trying to get it over here. But I'm serious though. Stop it. Y'all need to open your eyes. There is no hate over here. None. But y'all need to open your eyes. Come on now. Open your eyes. Where's the remedy? Where is the remedy? None. The guy yeah, goes live that. every time I go live. Now that's Susie went live. live. He goes live. He stopped talking about you. Go live. Now, one time did I go live and he didn't go live. Now, all you people that was on his channel a lot, you didn't put that together? And why? He did it just the other day. Every time I go live, he go live. Why? And then when he go live, he's looking at folks on Philadelphia streets. And then the you got people. What the fuck does that got to do with anything? About, God, man, stop it. Stop it, people. You get you get everything you deserve. You you everything, and that's why I don't feel bad for you. I'm talking all this tough shit now, and I'm amping all that. But those that know me know my heart. And when we talk for real, one on one on the phone or face to face, and I'm helping each when we helping each other, that's the oldest you get. But now you're getting the oldest that I don't understand, folks. I'm surrounded by idiots. And it's a perfect fact that this is not for everyone. Everyone cannot go. This is not made for everyone. And if you're over there, it's not made for you. And I'm going to say that. How could it be? How could it be? Whoever you follow, their language has to be more articulate than yours it has to be that more vast than yours their lifestyle needs to be better than yours at one name one facet of area in his life where his life is better than yours i'm talking to myself there is none there ain't none, none. y'all talk better than him y'all smarter than him none. Y'all probably dress better y'all keep his bills paid y'all keep buying Thank that you. bullshit keeps you. him afloat and let's talk about that he has no remedy for his utilities. His utilities get paid every month like everybody else off the donations that you guys send him. And off the weed well, that he, he sells. Yeah, he, I said it. He sells weed too. Ugly ass At 44 dude. years old. At, four, at, at 44 years old. He makes $1,000 on uh, YouTube. And yes, I'm going to say it right now. I'm the one. Watch this one. I'm the one. Yeah, I said it. I'm the one that deleted all your videos on YouTube because your dumb ass made me the administrator. You did. That's how <laughs> dumb you is. Got him. Got him. Got him. That's how dumb you is. So after you got to disrespecting me, hating on me for no reason, I went in and I deleted all them videos that had my likeness on it that you lied to me about, I deleted all of it. And I deleted all the rest of them. So that's why your YouTube check went from $1,040 to $800 and some dollars because all them YouTube videos got deleted from your site, which means you can't draw revenue off that anymore. Yes, I did that. And there's nothing you could do about it because your dumb ass made me the administrator. Yes, you're a dumb ass. Not the government coming in and erasing your stuff like you went on there. You and your little counterparts trying to seem like, oh, you so you know so much. You know so much. The government had to come in. Right. Man, you don't know. Right. No. Man, they had about five of them no. over there. Damn, you must be doing right. You must be doing you right. You must, we, we on it. We on the right path, y'all. We oh, on the right man. path. The whole time. I was sitting there laughing at him. I was sitting there laughing at him, bro. I was sitting there laughing like, look at this. You got the right one. See, I'm a Scorpio. I love hard. And you came after me for no reason. Because I was honorable towards you. I really was. I went and I drove to see you. And you made it. And you tried to make that seem like that was weird. Huh? You was an idiot. I, I enlightened your YouTube page. Me. Me. I brought value to your yeah. channel. What yeah. you talking about now with your dumb ass? What? Nothing. 
I brought value to your channel. Yes, I said it. I brought value. Nothing. I drove up your YouTube ratings and your viewership oh. time so you could get that check. I did that. Not bragging, but I was trying Otis, to help. I wanted say, to bring let in me say this, Otis. people. So don't try to circumvent it and make it seem like I didn't bring no value. And I was doing it for the help because I wanted to. I didn't want nothing in return. I promise you I didn't. I wanted nothing in return. I just wanted to help the people because I thought you was doing a good thing. Again, I was there when you helped feed the homeless. I was there when you gave out the coast. All that is true. I'm not denying any of that. But them little two little nice things that going to get you in them gates of heaven. You still a bum. You still ain't shit. You still crooked. And the clock is still right Fact. twice a day. A Fact. broken clock is still right twice a day. So you can help folks, but you can still be harmful to the people. But You can still be a crook to the people. You can still be a cheat to the people. You can still be a liar, a bad liar at that. But it's not even your fault. It's the people that follow you. Who the hell follows someone with a scully but, and but, a, but, but, but when he don't, a bank with a damn security? Who follows someone like that? And before you say, well, are you crazy as hell. No, nah, I already had my agenda. I already knew what I was doing. I already knew what I was doing. I was playing in the mud. Yeah, you could call it what that you want to call it, but we all do it. We all do it. We all get into a situation. We all get into a situation where we think at the time, this is a great situation. I made a right decision. Facts. I found this group. Facts. But then you get in there Facts. and you realize that, damn, something ain't right. Something's off just a little bit, but it's off a little right. bit. It's still something there that I need. But it's still off. I know this person not telling right. the truth all the way. I know he exaggerating a little bit, but old boy right there, or the young lady right there, he or she knows something. So I got to stay in this mud. I don't want to be associated, but I got to stay here because this information is good. Okay, well, apply that to your real life, Otis. Okay, how that applies to me. When I first met Midwest a year or so ago, through the my, for the Chris Hauser situation, the jurist, whatever. We was all on that 1099, going down the rabbit hole. Yes. Then months later, after we all realized that the 1099 were not panning out, we all realized that we all came to that realization. Then I started realizing, hold on, I'm here, but other stuff is coming up. Not from him, Midwest, but from other individuals. So I stayed in the mud. We all do that. That's life. How many of you are in a job right now that you don't want to be in that job, but you got to stay there? It's called yeah. playing in the mud. So I chose to stay and play in the mud, even though I knew it was some shenanigans going on. For the record, again, full transparency. When I was poor. Hey, oh, bit. Oh, this Oh, let me tell you some shit before you continue. Oh, what's up? Yo, what's up? I done talked to I done, I done talked to so many people, right, bro? And mm -hmm. I and I ain't even gonna hold you. I talked to so many people that that he done took these people money for promising them a home, promising them a home, uh, or some type of uh, promising them a home and a car and shit. And these people done paid fifteen hundred, three thousand. 2000 he charged them and he told everybody he had a 19 million dollar property that he already purchased because that's around the time i met him and he said he had this property that property going on and that and what happened was he took all these people money in 2022 and when the 1099 a's ain't work for him because he was doing it the wrong way like the united states church used to lend all that bullshit. When that shit did not work for him, he ghosted everybody. So mm -hmm. these are new people that's in this group now that don't really understand and know what he is, what he is about. A white lady made a video on this dude and catching him in the act of his scamming. And she made a video on it. And I'm going to drop the, give you the link and I'm going to drop the link on my community tab. 
this man has scammed people, especially uh, in the Atlanta area, out of thousands and thousands of dollars. Because that one lady, like I said, she was he went live like we got a community member that needs some, you know, needs some donations. She getting evicted. Bear West took her last dollars and said that she can he can get the eviction move or whatever, give her a remedy. Them nine sheriffs came to the house and put this lady out her house and Midwest took her last and never gave the money back. And this is the part that the new people that follow him now, they don't know about the people from 2022, 2021, 2020. Think about it, y'all. How the hell could you be on YouTube since 2015 and you get consistent remedies, but there's no increase in your life? And no, all, and all the people that's around him now, they are not from the, a year or two ago. These are all new people. Right. Think about it. Brand new. They're too. all brand new. Right. And another thing too, I'm going to call it out because it doesn't take a rocket science, but people don't, don't even think about this and, and they don't put this together. This man has 12 point whatever thousand subscribers. I want you guys to let this sink in. He has 12,000 subscribers on a regular basis. On a regular basis, he has on the average of 30 something people in his live. Two digit live numbers, but he has 12,000 subscribers. So for those of you that don't know what's going on, this asshole paid for subscriptions. Pretty I much. Know it's for uh, there is no way on this earth, you can have 12,000 subscribers and only 30 some people in your life. Impossible. Facts. You should have Impossible. on the average, on the average of a couple of hundred. Average. At least six, seven hundred, five hundred. You paid for those subscribers, easy. sir. All you my money were that. earned. All of them. And for the record, again, with your dumb ass, you telling people on your live right now or in the past few weeks that I went on your show to steal subscribers to my channel. Again, for the umpteenth time, people, you need to use common sense. I hate keep talking about this, but I hate stupid people. Stupid people should not breathe. He needs to stop breathing. Now, hold your breath. Just, just stop. If you averaging on the high end, 30 to 40 people on your live, let's say on a good day, which is not even possible, all 40 people subscribed to my channel. Let's say that I got 40 new subscribers. Do you guys know how much it takes to be monetized? You need a thousand subscribers. So even if the 30 folks did come subscribe, how did you help me out? How? Them 30 people didn't do nothing. Don't get me wrong, I'm grateful for the 30, but you didn't do nothing to monetize me. I have almost 3,000 subscribers now. Thank you guys for that. Almost 3,000. I had 250 when I first started following Midwest because I wasn't really focusing on my podcast. But I realized I'm spending a lot of time on somebody else's platform when I have my own. Let me reinvest more time back in my own platform. Also, since I got this case beat now, now I have time to focus back on it. Because I didn't. I, was, I didn't know if I was going to be in jail or not. I'm not going to lie. So that's the reality of this, people. Stop letting that man tell you I went on this platform to build up my platform. Dumbass boy, you only got 30-some people in your damn life. 30 something. I got over, I got almost 3,000 subscribers. You didn't help do none of that. Stop it. Why are you trying to convince yourself that you helped me so bad? Why? So Why? You, say you got a 21 years and shit. You didn't help me do nothing. Why you, stop telling people you helped me get out of 21 years. You didn't do nothing. Nothing. Get yourself out that ugly ass house you in. Get yourself, stop lying to the people and pay your utilities. Stop lying to the people and saying you got special deposits. You, 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 you can only do three of them. 
Remember that time you got a special deposit a few months ago and you showed it and you called on the phone and had your goons circling around the house protecting you? But why you <laughs> in that ugly ass house then? See, I, I remember everything. I don't let nothing get past me. I just keep it in the memory bank. You told a lot of lies, sir. A lot. Facts. A lot. Facts. I remember specifically, you, you said you got a special deposit several months ago. You sold that little band. You didn't show nobody how you got it. And then you had the nerves. So you go overboard with that shit. I could tell you one of them dudes when you was young, you was a habitual liar. You lied a lot. And how tough are you really? You 40-something years old still claiming a game. How tough are you, bitch boy? I shouldn't have said that. And they got the FBI agents. You in the game. Got the FBI agents. You FBI. You got you got scream out of the FBI. The mother uh, the, uh, the other man you so holier than thou, God this, let's let's pray. But then the next you so mad, you claiming you are uh from 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 the game, from from Chicago. Man, sit your buck tooth ugly ass down, 40-something years old. You ain't got shit going on. Your biggest hustle is hustling the people. That's, That's it. That's what you're doing. You hustling the people. You can talk about me all you want. I don't care. I'm standing on facts. And come see me then. Like I came and saw you. Come see me. And trust me. Don't get it twisted. And you know I ain't lying. And ain't no threat. I'll come see you again. No threats. Ain't no fighting involved. No. I, I will come talk to you. If you oh, want to nice fight. <laughs> if you want to talk, but come see me. You're a habitual liar. You're a bum. You have no remedies, and you're lying to the people. And God, please forgive me, but I'm just getting tired of you, bro. You're disrespecting me. You're disrespecting my wife. All for what? All for what? Where's your remedy? Let's talk about remedies. Let's play big bank, take little bank. Let's talk about remedies. Right. Where's your remedy? Facts. Who cares about your status correction, especially if you don't display how to use it? Now you're going to explain it now because I'm on your <laughs> head. Because I'm on your head. But explain Facts. what you're selling. And people, don't buy it. It's not worth no damn 750 I got the same one. You can get it from me for half the price. And you don't need no damn collateral number. Matter of fact, it ain't for half the price. I sell it right now for 200 I let it be known. You get the same one for 200 the same exact one, and you don't need a collateral yes, number. Sir. You make up your own collateral number, and you put a lien on that one. Don't get me started. See, I read. Uh, I'm, not I'm not slow. I'm not desperate. Yeah, I trip for that 750 but once I got them documents, I ain't gonna lie. Without his explanation, without no tutelage from him, my own edification, my own studies, I realized there's some nice documents. The hell with that collateral number. You can get your own collateral right. number, but the documents are powerful. So if you want it, I got it for 200 and you don't need that collateral number. The hell you paying them $750 for? The margin's off. He don't tell you how to use it. At least I'm going to tell you what to do with it. Have I told you always what to do with certain things? Don't I break down everything to you? Huh? So what's going to make this different? Stop playing with me, y'all. Stop it. Again, if you're over there, get off here and stay over there because it's not going to work. It's not. I need people who are on their right mind who know this is not an overnight thing. But if you want the right material, if you want the right paperwork, if you want the right structure, we got it. It ain't easy. And Otis, and Otis let me it. tell you this. Let me tell you this. Whoever that, I think, user, user. Uh-huh. He commented in the chat that Wiley Hell Fix Investment Trust. Please get that out of here. That's that sovereign citizen stuff like that. I forgot that dude was. I seen the robots and patriots that whiffed like that. Trust like that. I know what he's talking about. Mm -hmm. It has nothing to do with it. That only deals with actual investment trust that registers with the SEC. So, Usa. I know this this is out this is like a couple hours ago you put it in the chat, but a lot of sovereign citizens that try to make the pivot would say, Oh, your trust, your estate is a wily hell fixed investment trucks to whip. But you gotta remember what I said earlier. I, I gotta correct this part because I don't want to see ahead, ahead. Most definitely. deal ahead. with the remnants of the sovereign citizen shit that does not work. Remember, oh. there is no trust with your name on it. There's no trust fund with your name in it. 
It's an implied trust held in trust. There is no trust fund. Don't look for a thing. Don't look for a thing. Hey, Lamont. He said, he, I was that. he said I was reading that from the Irish yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Right. But that doesn't apply. That that is specific. I see what you're saying, but that has no relevance to what we're doing. That's what I'm saying. It has mm-hmm. no relevance to what we're doing. And thanks for the as clip. Far as, yeah. yeah, as far as just recouping just basic credits, the Wiley Hell Fixed Investment Trust has no relevance to what we're doing. Right. Thank you, you, yeah. sir, for making that comment earlier. Thank you, Lamont, yeah. for the clarity. And thank you, you, sir, for yeah. responding for the clarity. This was all this yeah. about. I love this. That's all. This, was, I, this is what this is about. No BS, no filter. If someone gives out some information that might a little bit be off or whatever, if someone knows how to come on top of it to, to straighten it out, this is what this is about. I promise you, this is how it's supposed to go just the way he just broke it down. He saw something, Lamont did, and he wanted to uh, bring it up, and he brought it up in a nice, respectful way, said, yeah, but that's the, that's what this is about. No BS, no filter, no sugarcoating, not lying to the people, saying we're going to sell you something and it's going to be available and you're going to get your remedy the next day. No, this is the real. You see our faces. We not on nobody else's channel and you don't see their face, but they telling you stuff. How is that so? Hey, How can you trust anybody on anybody channel who comes in on a regular basis out of nowhere, mind you? All you know is a name. You don't even see their face. And now him and ugly ass dude, best friends now. That didn't raise a red flag to you? He doesn't Man, know his face. Never shows his face. Doesn't show his face. When people Never. are following, he doesn't show his face. But he the one that told him about the silver. Doesn't show his face. Right. So he told right. Him about the silver. right. And the person he told Dirty him, him good, silver, yeah. he didn't even do it his damn self. Man, what's that right. his damn self? Are you kidding Midwest me? Midwest ain't getting a remedy from the silver. He holds silver classes. Midwest has not got a remedy for the silver. And here's the thing. This is regulations. You can look it up. The United States government has never in the history since 1776 or whatever you want, the Declaration of Independence, however far you want to go back, the United States government has never given out a thousand percent interest on any commodities or any securities or anything cashed into the treasury. The interest rates are regulated. They're He's regulated. It. You can't right there. There's no private process, private placement program, and you get a thousand percent interest on silver. The silver price is like twenty three, twenty four dollars per ounce, and the value of it that's sitting in your account is either gonna go up or down depending on the market. You right now, the stock market, yeah. the hedge funds will ever allow you to have a thousand percent interest. Never in history. And I'm not even trying to be funny, and I'm gonna be real. And I'm sorry to tell you, but mighty glad to let you know. Even if it is true, he would know. Look at him. No. How would he know? <laughs> and the person that told yeah. him, that, listen, how would he know? Right. Especially now. That's a question. That's a question they don't ask. But that's a question. That's a question they don't ask. You need today. Because I don't watch it, but somebody told me, said that they're supposed to get a class today on them telling him what the next step is. But he has yet to say to this day, and I could be wrong, and I doubt it. Because if he did, he'd be bragging about it. He has yet to this day yep. said that he's done it himself. And nobody, nope. again, I'm, I'm finna offend somebody because I already asked. I asked it on the live, and I asked. Nobody had the word with all the acts that man. By the way, did you do it yourself? Scared the acts. Nobody. He gave another and, class and, today, West, and he clearly right. stated, or he don't state right. that he did it himself. He never does. Right. So never why does. are you following him? Now, for the record, so I can explain myself for real, did I send my server in? Yes, I did. Ask me why. It wasn't because of no damn thousand dollars. I mean, no, no thousand uh, percent. No, I did that based on my own research and study. 
I realized that I would oh, rather do that. have it sitting in an institution than sitting at home with me right now. I would rather have it sitting there. And in worst case scenario, I could get my physical commodity back. It's Facts. sitting there. Facts. So I knew what I was doing. I, yeah. there, there was a method to my madness. Now, full transparency, when I first heard of this, did I want this to be true? Yes, I did. I would be a lie to say if I didn't want it to work. But then once I stopped being desperate and I started using common sense and I started asking myself common sense questions, even if this is true, how would he know this? And not talking about nobody or judging nobody, he hasn't done it himself. And if he did do it himself, why is he telling everybody? This is something that right. you would do yourself. Why are you trying to free everybody because else to get to make thousand percent a day when you're not doing it yourself? Because, because you know it's that a, don't work it's a, and you're taking three feet. It don't work. Exactly. You know that they exactly. so gullible. You know that they so gullible. Exactly. If they don't work. They're not going right. to bring it back to you. They're going to continue to follow your right. ass. That's desperate. Right. So all you desperate right. folks that's over there. Stay over And it was there. something new. And Stay he had something new there. to give him. He can't talk. Remember, remember, this came after the CP575 class, so he couldn't talk about that no more, so we had something new. Ooh, mm -hmm. silver shit. And you know what it is? You know what it is? I'm going to be honest with you, bro. And a lot of people ain't going to like this shit, but I'll say it to their face. Matter of fact, I'll smack the shit out of one of them if they ever tried to say something to me, and i give my address. Because I, 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 I ain't with the bullshit. You good, bro. you good. No, nah, I'm damn serious though. Like I ain't do eight years in the penitentiary for nothing. Like I wasn't all this was always like this. It ain't so gonna get there. We this, just bro. right now we just been. It ain't, it ain't uh, gonna ever get there. We we, we I just know even shit. We just shit. Play. I did. I done gave. I done gave. I'm at my address. Yeah, Again. I get him at my physical address. Yeah, I get him at my physical up. address. He's not showing yeah. up. I mean, if he can get past the Luger and the AR, then go ahead. He cool. But anyways, forget all that. Let me ask you this, bro. I'm totally convinced. And I, I'm gonna get back on camera in a second. I'm totally convinced mm -hmm. that what they do is he has Dirty Wood go research information on new shit. He has Dirty Wood information to have them inf research information on new shit to bring to the people. He comes, holds the class and seminars, then he breaks bread behind the scene with them. That's all they do, bro. He goes because Midwest does not have the intellectual ability to do research. Really, he's kind of he doesn't have the ability. Mm -hmm. So he has Dirty Wood and all them other Dirty Wood and the other one, Money Boy, go pull up new information that's new that the people haven't heard before. Then he throws a class in the NDA with it, sell it for 350s, sell it for this, sell it for that, and then comes back and sells it to the group. Now, think about it. Everybody's been following this man for a long time, a year, two years. And at the end of at least two years, there hasn't been any type of remedy still you're still sitting in the same house and you're absolutely right it's not even about the remedy no more over there it's about what can i do what can i sell to get the fiat currency out of the people that's why anybody who asks questions he attacks them as they doing this or they don't disbelieve that he'll block them anybody that starts to question what he's really doing mm -hmm. he's like, i ain't got to show nobody no proof as many people did it he catches the attitude then everybody gets mad then he ends up banning them midwest needs a constant flow of new people in his class because the more the people hang around the longer they hang around the more it's going to be evident that they're not getting any remedy and he does not want people sitting around in his class for more than a year that's the honest guy. That's the honest truth. Well, listen, though. Uh, I agree for the most part on uh, on everything that you're saying. I will say this. There is a lot. There's going to there's gonna always be desperate people. I don't want to use the yes. word desperate. I'm not afraid of desperate people to be a derogatory thing, but there's going to always be people who want to get be, who's going to get behind in their mortgage, yep. in their car yep. or whatever, and they're going to be introduced to this proverbial rabbit hole and they're going to, yep. so it's going to always be those people. It's going to always be the, it's a new person right now. Somebody new right now, it just happened. Boom. They came across something. They, 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 they came across that, uh, that video, that five minute video, how to, uh, my fault, who is your straw man? That's where it always starts. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> it's somebody right hey, now. That first video, uh, for the first time right now, who is your straw man? And they got. He said, "Who's your straw man?" He said, "Who's your straw man?" <laughs> but listen, I'm I'm not lying, right? That's how they go. No, you you now you're telling the truth because when I first started, that's what they threw in my face. But yeah. I started, I was wise enough to know. Why is this getting so much backlash? What do you mean the private side? I said the court's rejecting it. And the dudes got mad at me for challenging, so I left that sovereign citizen group real early. Because it wasn't making sense. And if you look at it, it doesn't make sense. It don't make sense. But I'm telling you this right now. If you think Midwest... Okay, forget it. Even if you believe Midwest has... If you still want to follow him. No one's... I don't even care what you do. Yeah. But the question yeah. is, why don't you ask him Midwest, can you show me any proof right now, black and white, of any results that you had from either the 1099A, that $19 million home that he said he was buying? Because Midwest was actively charging people for 1099As and shit. But now he says that shit don't work, whatever the case may be. But why don't y'all ask him, Midwest, Thomas Legacy is showing results. Oh, it's who's showing results? Where are your results at, Midwest? Can you show us anything? And watch the attitude that he catches with you or think you trying to come kick up shit just because you're asking the question. Now, right. watch the attitude. Why would it be attitude if you're asking because he gets mad that you're exposing this scam Exactly. his girlfriend is putting the pressure on him because... He been promised her a new house for two years, and he's still in the same house. Mm, mm, mm. And what I'm doing, I'm fact. giving him hope. I'm giving him hope, and he doesn't realize it and doesn't want to acknowledge it. I'm giving him hope because I know he's watching this, obviously. He saw the remedy I got with the voucher, and I know he, he did it too, that. obviously. So I'm giving him hope. So now he's hoping that his go through so then he's gonna he's, he's, he's gonna keep his minions around and that's how they work there's a yep. new there's there's a newbie born every second within this a sucker born every second within a this life born every second so, so the desperate people there are a pool of desperate people but you can't be desperate forever and that's what i'm going to say now now let's bring it all home let's bring it all the way home this is the beautiful part about about this because I promise you. Before you man, before I, you bring home, can I ask you one last question? Yeah, sure. What's up? Before you bring it home, can I promise you ask you one last question? Yes. Uh, before you go, I just want to ask you a question. Maybe maybe mm -hmm. you can give me some insight. All right. Uh, let me ask you this. Is there, okay, it's one thing about being desperate, right? Now, you could be desperate by floating to this group, floating to this group, paying for this, paying for this. But what is it with it that the desperate people over there, like, stay right over there desperate? It's because they already put so much money in and brought all the five past seminars and they don't want to leave with all their money in the pot because they paid for this seminar, that seminar, status correction, ID, and nothing has worked. And so they felt like they're too invested to go anywhere else. I know the or answer. Just... Oh, I know the answer. Okay, yeah, that's the question. That's the question. Yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm about to answer it. And here, yeah. here's the answer. Yes. And will nobody ever going to admit this. But here's the answer. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The human is designed to get things done very simple without that much thinking and they want the answer right there. So if I can tell you, I could sell you a template and you behind in your mortgage or you're not behind in your mortgage, but you want to get rid of it. Right. Just, you, just do this right. template, send in this bill right there, out there and it's going to be done in a month or two. That's what you're going to do. So after you do that and you realize right. it doesn't work, and you stand over right. there because some more stuff keeps coming up. So you're going to keep trying that. Now watch this. Please stay with me. Everything uh -huh. that you try, wherever you at, is all simple. It's real simple. Okay. There is no studying required. Here, just get this template uh, and put this there, uh, do that, and send it in. There is no studying required. I'm going to say it again. There uh, is no studying required when you over there. over there. Get this template, okay. whether it's the status correction or whatever, yeah. with no explanation, yeah. no guidance, no instructions. Get it, get it notarized, and do this. Go put it in the case. Don't put it in as evidence. That didn't even come up until months later. He was just saying, put it in the case. Uh, he didn't even know. Let's make that I remember that, that. Put it in the case. Now, I remember that. Now, the truth of it is, if it's something that requires 
work, time, and study. And there's still no guarantee. Who wants to do that? What sounds easier to sell? Come over here. Yep. And you pay yep. 750 for the status correction. Yep. And you're going to be fine yep. with no explanation. Or yep. come over here. There is no money required. You might want to get a trust or whatever, but this trust has uh instructions, and I'm going to show you exactly how to use it. And oh, by the way, it's not an overnight process. You really got to put that work yeah. in. Oh, you want to yeah. save your house? This is what I did, but it might not work for you. You, you have to do this. Yeah. Exactly. But you have to do this, and it's not going to be overnight. Oh, you want to save your car? If you don't have a garage, I'm telling you right now, based on what you're showing me, and I'm looking at your paperwork, I'm being honest with you, since you don't have a yeah. garage, you need to go ahead and turn the car in because it's going to take more than a, a lot of time for you to save oh, your yeah. car. They're going to re they're going to come and steal it. They don't want to hear that. They want to hear the Understood. easy part. My car about to get repoed. I'm three months behind. Let me go over here because they said this could work with this template. That's what they want. Wow. And they get stuck in that because wow. it wants that don't work. They want the other templates. But let me tell you what happens in wow. real life. Wow. After the templates don't work back from 2016, you got to start studying. You got to start reading. Yeah. Wow. You got to start putting together, oh, I read this, so I'm going to do this, and I'm going to take this piece I got from the mind because he said the statute, and I read it. Oh, I'm going to do that. That's what they don't want to do. They don't want to hear that it always right. me to save my house and the other houses and getting this remedy. Right. I had to study. Right. And I had oh, to put yeah. that paperwork okay. in. They don't want to hear that part. And that's the so truth. They, right. Uh, that's the truth. So they it's, just only, so it's all listen. desperate people. Right. Right. But right now they're talking to right now people are listening to a real teacher, myself and you, who are breaking it down that it is not an overnight situation. It is not. Who wants to hear right. that? They Nobody. rather leave her because I just said it's not going to be overnight and go over there right. Right. where they promising you it's going to be overnight and you know damn well it's not going to be. And guess what? You don't even have to study. Just pay me X amount of dollar and you're going to be all right. You're going to be free. And the people you're talking to, I had to say it, have no understanding of accounting, have no understanding of the basic IRS process, have no understanding of a trust or how they work, don't have no, they still under the impression that their allegiance is them. They have no idea of nothing, but they want that so powerful they, remedy. No. So when they say they want to be free, it's not really the fact that they want to be free like knowledge sets you free they just want to be free of their obligation to honor the contract that they entered into freely basically they want to get out of they want to get out of shit without yeah. having to pay for it yeah basically and, continue and, to take and, and that part continue too. to take from the system continue that to take from too. the system but not give back continue that to take take, take out the system but not give back continue to leech 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 but not give back put into the system <laughs> right but let me say this okay I can understand, and, 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 and we're going to close. It's been, shit, this, it's four hours. Yeah. Oh, my God. This, yeah. ooh, this uh -huh. is, oh, we're going to go after this, but I understand the desperation because, again, I've been there, and I understand being new. When you're new and you're desperate, you tend to fall for things quickly and easily because you don't know if this person is genuine or not. You don't know until you know. So after you meet someone who portray themselves to be all knowing because you don't know that much. After you realize and gain a little bit of knowledge, you should realize that, hey, this person misled me. I'm intelligent enough now to leave and go somewhere else. But the messed up yeah. part about it is the average person don't. They stay there because it's easy for them. They stay there because yeah. it sound good. It sound easy. That's why every morning when he go live, he has the same numbers, 20 to 30 something, them same people. I can start, I can start yelling out the names, them same people. <laughs> God, forgive me. God forgive me. Ain't none of them have a remedy and none of them. I, I, it's, it's the truth. When someone show you who they are, believe them. If you keep showing up every day on somebody live and you know that, and I know that they ain't that smart and I'm looking at the people in the chat 
then the pe- the people in the chat ain't that smart. No, yeah, I said it. Hell now, no. You can be around no, her for a reason. If you want to play in the mud, I was playing in the mud. And I already explained what I was doing. I got my remedy from playing in the mud. And right. again, I didn't get it from his yes, dumb sir. ass. I got it from an individual who knew what he was doing. But I had to play in the mud. If you're not playing in the mud for a purpose and you just like getting dirty, use a fucking pig and stay in the mud. Stay in there. <laughs> Be in Facts. the mud for a purpose. Facts. Not because it's fun. Facts. You like Facts. staying in the mud. I didn't like it. But I had to stay in the mud to get that diamond. I got my diamond, and you witnessed it. Facts. That's the definition Facts. of playing in Facts. the mud. But when you don't know no better, Facts. keep on playing in the mud, and you get everything you deserve. <clears throat> I said it with a smile on my face. Keep on playing in it. When it's time for you to get elevated, you will get there. So sad to tell you, mighty glad to let you know. I'm on my horse now. I got mine. And there's more yeah. to get. There's more to get. I'm fine. I'm Impress fine. results said. I'm, I'm, Impress. I'm following folks that's not giving you remedy. Now, if it's just entertainment like Facts. a TV show, then that's what it is. Treat it as such. It's a TV show. Facts. Facts. Treat it as such. But Facts. if you treat it other than that, if you treat it more than a, just a entertainment purposes for two hours just to hear the alleged Christopher Harrell talk about the 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 music industry, uh, the, seeing the the dirty bums on Philadelphia, uh, sitting at somebody's kitchen table with the ugly wall behind you, talking about God knows what because he's trying to get his views. I mean his his uh view of his view hours up so he can get that little thousand dollar check a month without giving you remedy. And and, and every other what word bis- is, what uh, uh, what business uh, executive. Exactly. Uh, exactly. What bi- what business executive, business mind person sits around and just watch and comments and pretty much look at people's impoverished lives as a source of entertainment on the channel? What is Another the point of having an EDU? Another impoverished individual right. who goes out every night to a little hole in the wall who claims he this, he that, and come home and get, go live every morning. You it know, lives like be, be, and it's like, washing his oh face. And if he does wash his face, you need to wash it again and go live. <laughs> go live after I go live because I'm just living rent, rent, uh, space. I mean, rent, rent free in his head. He already went live earlier, wasn't talking about shit. And now, he knew I was going live today because he subscribed to my channel. Yeah, I'm letting all your secrets out now. I know you subscribe to my channel. I can see. Now, you probably wow. unsubscribed because I sold un- un- unsubscribe from yours a while ago. Right. But I know you subscribe. I know you get my alerts when I go live. You know when I go live. You purposely go live when I go live. You're an idiot. You too grown to be acting like that. You're an idiot. And you're a bum. You need to pray and get your life together and get out your situation. And yes, I will make the flyers for you. What you need a flyer for? A relocation? What? I'll yeah. make it for you. But you're a bum but and you have nothing but, to offer me. And you're lying to the people. For real. Because I'm getting tired of you. And I don't like how he tried to, but he tries to use God. He tried to use the most yeah, high, like blast from the Bl- of the most high. On, and most and the most high came to him in the dream and said, Ooh, I had a dream about it. The all caps, the estate needs to be the debtor. Hold on. The all caps, the estates needs to be the debtor on the 1099C. No, you got that 1099C because you never paid that bill that you owe. And they got tired of sending you letters and hounding you down, Mr. Special Deposits. Mr. Special Deposits, you had all these obligations. You did not take care of your debt bills and debt. And they sent you a 1099 C. They sent you a 1099C because they got tired of chasing you down for money that they knew you was not going to pay. Now, just because you didn't understand the 1099C, that does not mean the most high came to you and said, everybody needs to be the debtor now just because yours the debtor because y'all didn't understand the 1099C. I seen them trying to figure it out. I said, oh yeah, they light years behind. But that passage I read to everybody on the congressional record, does that passage sound like any of us should ever be the debtor on the 1099C? Just that passage I read earlier? No. Exactly. Exactly. 
Exactly. Otis, you are 100% correct, brother. I'm standing behind you. I know what's going on. I know the real. A lot of people, they just don't understand the nature. He stopped saying my name. He used to say my name a lot. He stopped saying my name. But I wouldn't be surprised But that he starts kicked back up again. And then but it doesn't matter. We're getting remedies over here. Right. And even if he show. keeps the right, and I don't want to be petty. I, I was trying to leave this alone. I, I ain't mentioned his name in over a week. I was good. But he goes tonight, goes live on purpose, and starts dogging me out. Bring my wife yeah. up. I mean, who does yeah. that? Dude, what 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 is it about me that's do, and now you got your minions who has no remedy, the frequency hackers who I have much respect for. Now you want to go against me? Dude, I don't even know you. But since you're talking. Yo has a bum too. You ain't got shit going for you because you following him. And what does he have to show? Nothing. How you gonna talk about somebody well, if, you don't even know me, bro? How? Are that's you crazy? That's me? a get with. That's called Are a you get kidding with. me? That's a get He's a with. bum. I got more remedy than he does. I can help you, sir. For real. Facts. Facts. For Facts. real. I already showed my receipts. Because you can so help me. So, yeah. Something else. Listen. <laughs> that's a fact. No, nah, it's a it's a fact. It's not. It's a fa it's a fact. It's a fact. It's a fact. Everything you said is true. We are gonna keep on that path because if the Most High is so much blessing them over there, and that's His blessing, what He has to do to survive the scheme, the scams. If that's if that's what He called the Most High blessing Him, the Most High blessing. I don't mm -hmm. want none of those blessings. Give me another I'm blessing, gonna say, Most High. I'm gonna I say something. Blessing. I mean this. Shit. The way you acting. I don't the way the way he acting, and I'm for real. I don't want to know your God the way you acting. Yeah, yeah. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart. I don't want to know Facts. your God. Yeah. I'm a man. I admit my faults. I'm fallible, like everyone else. I promise you, I come with clean hands. But the way you talk, I don't want to know your God, bro. I really don't. Again. I be trying to make this the last time I talk about this guy, but he makes it so hard. He started, he started trolling, trolling me while we doing the live, educating the people about some damn flyers. Who does that? You forty something years old. Who does that? Who does that? And you only went live because you were bored and you saw I was live, and then we educating the people. You didn't have no you intention he's, of going live. He You're an so idiot. Either. You so stupid. Hot and right all now. your followers are stupid and desperate. And I said it. Every last one of you. And if you're over here, for real, I, I, I appreciate you being over here. Don't get offended. But if you take offense to anything I said and you think I'm lying about your boy, get off my channel, unsubscribe to me, and stay over there. Because I don't want you here. I really don't. I don't. I hate fake people. I yeah. hate them. I deal with them because it's the world, but I hate fake people. Stay over there. Why are you here? And you don't have the fortitude to be over here anyway, because this is no quick remedy over here. This is for real folks who put the work in, and we already got time in. So our remedy's coming now because I already got that time in. Lamont already been getting this remedy because he put the time in, literally eight yeah. years. So yeah. what are y'all talking about? Yeah. This overnight shit is gone. Stop it. No. It would never happen. If you it think it's overnight, happen. get from over here and stay over there talking about me, uh, saying dispersing things about me and my wife all because of what? That's get from crazy. over here. And all this doing is motivating me. If you know me, this is motivating me. Where is your remedy at? Who all these, all these naysayers saying stuff about me? Where is your remedy? Because if you had it, you wouldn't be on here listening to me right now or over there listening to him. Let's talk facts. And I choose to be on here because I want to give the information to the people who deserves it. That's why I'm here. I don't have to be here. Remember, me and Wes used to say all the time, I ain't got to be here. Yeah, motherfucker, you do because you need the money. You got to be here. You got to be here. You got to be here. I'm having handicaps in our living room table forever. You got to be here. You got That's to. That's a fact. Especially after I deleted That's all your videos and that check is $400 short. So, so go re-up on some more weed and uh, go get some more status corrections money and some more trust that ain't really a trust for real. The verbiage don't even match the foundation. Yeah, I read it. Oh, wow. I got to be somebody. Oh, wow. You're a dumb idiot. Oh, wow.
be done. Oh, wow. The stuff you even sell is not even complete. All you guys who wow. got that foundation trust, you're idiots. I'm going to say wow. it. And you didn't have the nerve to question them to get your money back. That ain't no damn trust. The words don't even match it. Wow. It's foundation, but it's trust all through the day. Man, y'all don't even put, but I ain't even say nothing because wow. I ain't nothing to do with that. But that's all on y'all wow. desperate ass. Wow. Desperate people do desperate things. And he's live I mean, so right, what now, is- right now. So go on over there. But we taking care, so, so, but we taking, we getting shit done over here. The hard fact. workers. That's a fact. We, we, we lose sleep done. over here because I'm doing study that's and I'm paper. Come on now, stop it. Stop that's it. Fact. Come on now. I'm, I love this. Well, Otis, well, 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 Otis, I'm going to see you. I'm going yeah, to talk to Later on today, but I'm yep. gonna see you during tax class too. Y'all, yep. y'all already know what to do. Like I said, the proof is in the pudding. All right, we ain't gotta do much. Y'all already seen what we have to show. Like the proof is in the pudding. You, y'all already know it's two different levels. Y'all already, see, y'all can see it for yourselves. It's two different levels. And guess what? I still ain't monetized my channel yet. I don't. I really don't give a shit about that shit. That shit is right. It, everybody it, teaches. So I, I mean, personally, I, just, I mean, I don't really. I don't care. It's not a, a life goal of mine. Right. It, it happens, man, it happens. I don't care. It ain't nothing to be like strive for. But I just want to say that. Listen, y'all. I don't care whether it's me, Otis, who, or anybody else. You got to look at one thing, Madam G. You didn't say, and Mel- Melanie Jones. You was saying making a lot of good points too. You sir. You sir. You was saying. Uh, a lot of points too, but you gotta understand. You gotta understand. Uh, uh, if the, the person is teaching you, telling you what to do, telling you offering services, telling you to buy this, first thing you gotta look at is: Have you been successful? Because look at these successful businesses. How do they continue to make money? Because of their track record. A good lawyer because of his track record. A good company, a good store, a Fortune 500 company is because of their track record. So whenever you go buy a wear or buy something for you always got to look at their track record. And when we add up the dots, when we take all personal views, all subjection out of it, and we just look at it from an objective point of view, clear up, no cuts, just straight up. If you look at MWEDU, and you look at the track record, there is nothing that you can hold on and say, hey, I got this remedy directly from him, or I, he did, or anything on his own. Nothing that you can line up or attribute success to him. With that being said, and you knowing that, and if you still continue to follow, then don't get mad when you spend your last and nothing ever happens. That's, That's all I got to say. Yeah. That's all I got to say. All right. Hey. Well, all I right, pre- Otis, yeah, I appreciate, appreciate you, brother. Yeah. yeah. I see you yeah. I'm going to see you later on, bro. Peace out, too. Right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, listen, you guys. It's been four hours and 10 minutes. Uh, again, I did not realize it was going to be this long. I apologize for keeping you this long. I did not want to get into that last two hour tangent because, but he came into, yeah, it just, it rubbed me the wrong way. And I do apologize for that, but I ain't gonna lie. It was good for the views and the rating shit. People looking at it. Uh, I'm still going to make this video, uh, private, but let me address some things. You, sir. Yes. Um, you I know you have your own thing going on just based on what you're saying in the chat. That's beautiful. I know, of course, there's a lot of few people have their things, their own things going on. I know Melody Jones has her own thing going on. Beautiful. I know uh, Madam G has her own thing going on. I know uh, who else on her that's gone now. Uh, Jerrica, she has her own thing going on. That's, it's, that's beautiful. That's what this is about. I promise you, big difference from being in the situation to whereas you got, let me use myself. I know what I got going on. I know what I have going on in my life, what I have set up and what I'm trying to accomplish. So of course I go to different groups and different situations and get the information that I need. Am I active in all groups? No, not at all. Do I stick my head in some to get information? Am I more active than not in in some more than others? Yes. I have my own group, 13 members. 
I haven't been in there in a while. I speak every morning like I do, but I haven't shared anything yet because I'm still trying to get all these remedies together. And that's who I'm going to go help, my 13-member Telegram group. The point is, you have to have the wherewithal to know what's worthy of studying and what's not. What group is worthwhile and what's not. What group has some characters in it that you don't really like, but the information is good, so you choose to stay. That's my definition of uh, uh, called playing in the mud. You're playing in the mud. You're in a situation that you don't really want to be in, but the information is there, so you got to stay there. If you choose to, you don't have to, but this is what I'm talking about. Don't let anyone, me, Lamont, whoever, tell you how you get your information. It's up to you how you get it. And it's also up to you how you play the game. It's up to you how you play the game. You could be as many groups as you want. Who cares? It's up to you how you play the game and pick the right group. That's it. Just know groups are made and built different. My group was not in your group. If you come over here and you hear me talk about this type of lifestyle, just know you're going to hear from me that it can be done, but it's some work and it's not going to be overnight, period. That's my teaching. Or do you feel comfortable with going to those where you have to spend money every now and again? They don't give the full explanation on how to use the information, but you're hoping it works because you're in your dire situation and you want it to work. There are more groups out there like that than the way I portray myself. Way more of those than the way I portray myself. I like the way I portray myself. Have I been in them other groups? Yes, I have. A lot of them. The four, the W4 sandwiches, the uh, the Lone Star. As a matter of fact, let, let me put it up real quick. Now I'm going to let y'all go. It's been over four hours. But shit, it's hella groups. Uh, let me see. Bill Ideals, The Leading Way, uh... Uh, what, what else up here? Uh, Felicia's private group, the Lone Star Pack, uh, W4 Sandwich. Uh, it's hella groups, way more than I'm a part of. I haven't been in a lot of them in a while, but we all come on now. If you pull up your Telegram, uh, board right now, I'm pretty sure there are you, you, you in more than four or five groups. So I get it. And all of them are not built the same. They are all not created the same. Trust me, I get it. I'm not, I, I'm, I'm not naive. But we all know one of those groups are very helpful. I would hope so. One of them is. The rest of them, they got little pieces. You go in their little library, the, the little media file, the little audio files, get certain things. Yeah. You have to know what to pick and live with it and live with it. I'm going to say it again. Know what to pick, and once you pick it, you have to live with it because you picked it. You picked it. So you have to live with it. What's that? With that being said, listen, I thank you guys. It's been over four hours. Thank you, thank you. I will be back in the next day or two. Um, I don't know what else to say. Uh, hopefully, I covered everything. Hopefully, you got some good information from this today, minus the gossip and me ranting. Hopefully, you got some good information. Um, what else? With that being said, I don't know. If you like the show, please, please hit the like button. I need the likes. Uh, subscribe. Share this information with others if you would like, if you think deem is necessary. If you would like to say, oh, I'm tripping. I forgot to do this. Damn. My fault. Let me go. Let me find them eights. My fault. We about to go. It's 22 people on here. Let me find these eights. I said I'm going to take down the first five eights to give this uh, trust away. My fault. Let me find these eights. Let me do this real quick. It's going to be less than five minutes and then we out of here. I know it's late for a lot of people based on the area you in. But let me get these names down real quick. I'm going to spin this wheel and then we are up out of here. Because I did promise that. And I want to be a man of my word. Let me find this chat got long. Let me find these eights. Give me one second. Okay, here we go. Okay. Here we go, you guys. I apologize. Let me write these names down. And we're going to get this started. I'm going to get you guys up out of here. So I'm going to take down, I asked this earlier, I'm going to take down the first five or six people who left an eight in the chat who wants to get a chance to uh, get the uh, 508 C1A when they trust. So let me do that right now. But in the meantime, you know the play. I'm going to play my music. 
until I get these names together. So, Bird, relax, y'all. We all right. Otis, who? Otis, music. Ain't nobody coming to see you, Otis. Hopefully you enjoyed the music. Hopefully it didn't take you take me too long. All right, the names that I have on the wheel for a chance to uh, win the. Uh, oh, let me see. You gotta send us off with the song, Mister uh, Minister Otis. All good spirits and. <laughs> <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. Okay. Um, the names I have on the uh, the wheel is Jade, Melanie. Kevin S. User, House of, I didn't write the whole name because I was running out of space, and uh, Monica. My fault. No, I'm sorry. Monique. Okay. Monique. Got you. Hopefully I'm pronouncing your name correctly. What you're going to have a chance to win is will be my um, 508C1A Trust. It's part, it's under the classification of a 501C3. Okay. It's a powerful trust. All explanations and and um of on how to utilize it, the lifestyle, how to obtain the EIN, how to use it, how how to use because it's going to be two trusts in one, two separate trusts. How to use one for private, and how to use one for commerce with an EIN number. Also, which is real important, which is I live it on a regular uh, basis. I'm a so-called two-time felon. In their system, but in my system, God's system, my own world within my trust, I have a gun trust and I'm able to carry my own weapon. I carry it on a regular basis every day on my person, in my own convenience with no problems, never had a problem. And I wish they would. All facts. So that's what you're going to have. You Everything I just told you in a lot more broken down in over three hours of uh, uh, examples testimonials and situations on the how to utilize the trust. Everything is there. Trust me. Everything is there. Not like anyone else's where you don't know what you're getting. You're getting what you're paying for a lot more. 
So that's what you're getting. So let's get this spiel. I mean, let's get this wheel, the spear. Here we go. Good luck to all the winners. Good luck to all the winners. And here we go. Who that? Who that? Kevin Ness. Kevin Ness, you are the winner of the 508C1A Trust. So what I need from, from you, Kevin S., would be for you to email me at my email address, otisho1 at gmail.com, otisho, the number one, at gmail.com. Uh, email me your address, and I will send it off to you first thing in the morning. I'm not going to lie and say I do it tonight. I do it first thing in the morning. It's 12 o'clock here in St. Louis, and I'm tired. Uh, but, yes, um, I thank you guys for tuning in to another episode of the Otis Who Podcast. I enjoy you. Again, thank you. I am monetized now. It is I, It is from, from your help, a conglomerate of help. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Again, if you want to continue this type of information and just continue my journey, not just about this information, about the information I pull, pull up on a regular basis and about my podcast, continue to tune in. Continue to tune in. And I'm serious. I'm an open book. If there's any topics that you would like for me to talk about, world events, for us a podcast, Drop it in my email. Send it to me. If you would like to be a guest on my podcast, send me the information. Just like I have Thomas Legacy up here. If you have something interesting that you would like to share to people or promote or whatever, call me. Talk about it. And I can see if I can bring you up on the show as a guest to let you get out your information. I have no problem with that. But with that being said, I appreciate you. Like button, subscribe button, and check this out. Until next time. Ain't nobody, ain't, no, ain't, ain't, ain't nobody coming to see you, Otis.